Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm here at this abandoned Burger King. Nah, you didn't come here to see that. You came here to see what's back behind me, way down there where that mural is. So come on, let's take a look. So we do have an abandoned Burger King back there that looks absolutely deplorable and disgusting. And then we have this very colorful um, decorated house here, but what's next to it is what I'm here for. I'm here to check out the um, record store, cassette store, whatever you want to call it. But look at that mural. That is amazing. I love it. And here it is. This is everybody's records and CDs. And this is where I come to get all of my cassette tapes and vinyl records. Look at they have it all decorated up for the holiday season. Isn't that amazing? And then you can see up there, everybody's records and CDs. That elf looks like he's a little high on something. <laughs> Just having a little high on the Christmas spirit. Happy holidays here. And that was a restaurant that day. That yeah, and the thing that I like the most is this big neon sign that's in the window here. That's pretty cool. So here's what I come in here for. They got all of these cassettes here, and this is only a fraction of them. Twisted Sisters, Spice Girls, ooh, Spice Girls? I don't know that I like Spice Girls. Ella Fitzgerald, ew. Where is the good stuff, Prince? There you go, these are all the cassettes that they have. I'm gonna get a few of these as well as exchange out the two that didn't work out so great, but look at that. I'm in the north side of Cincinnati, Ohio. This is a really cool little downtown area that I think it's kind of up and coming well. It sort of died and now it's kind of coming back to life. And I'm here to show you another one of these awesome record stores that I get a lot of my cassettes, vinyls, and CDs at, so come on, follow me. Here it is, this is the front of the place. This is the Shake It record store and I always loved the front of this place, how it's decorated. And it's in this really old style building. Look at the old tile floor. All right, everyone, I think I'm going to get these two cassettes but look at all the other cassettes they have they have a pretty big selection of them and these are the two that i found out of here that look like they have some good stuff good prices too a dollar 99 and they look like they're in really good condition too yeah. did you find anything good uh, keep looking wait what did you got all of that aerosmith, aerosmith. mystical vision albion offering and two shorts and I only know Aerosmith out of all of that group. <laughs> but man, they have just all these CDs. Look at how many CDs they have. And then they've got the record section and there's a basement. Heading downstairs, this is cool. Look at this sign, that is so cool. That's a, I love that comic book sign. Some of these are so old, I've never even heard of them. See, they have like a little museum down here that features the sounds of Cincinnati. That is cool. Uh, even here at the record store, people are obsessed with Fiona still. I don't understand. So down here in the basement beyond the little museum, they have all kinds of records. Oh, look at that, Barbara Streisand. Wait, this is like a new Barbara Streisand. Oh, it's like a picture disc. That is a really weird album. I never heard these before. There's so much stuff in here that I've never heard of. <gasps> Over here we have Christmas stuff. Oh, look at this, it's the Grinch and a whole bunch of other Christmas stuff. There's Dolly. It looks like Dolly Parton Christmas. Yep, Dolly Parton holiday Christmas. This whole, all this whole section is Christmas. <gasps> what the absolute? 
I, this is the one thing I hate from South Park, but it is so cool to see still. I think that was the most retarded thing they ever did on the show was talking poop. What the? Even though I make jokes about poop all the time, and I would not pay $21 for poop. All right, so here's what I scored from everybody's records, tapes, CDs, vinyl, whatever they call that place. First one is Cops. I guess that's two, or is that three? Beverly Hills Cops. Anyways, uh, I have the first one, and so I was like, oh man, another one to the set. Then we've got the very best of the monkeys, the original soundtrack from Fame, Elvis number one hits, and then there's the original recordings of Blood, Sweat, and Tears greatest hits. Something interesting about this Elvis one, I opened it up, the cassette's black, which is kind of interesting, trying to do this one-handed, sorry. Cassette's black, but it says, from Gene, 1996. As I then proceed to drop it on the floor like a dumb idiot. <laughs> sorry, you guys, <laughs> it'll be okay. But yeah, those are all the tapes and they're all in really pretty good condition, of course. You know, some are better than others due to number of plays, the age of them, how well they were stored, and just overall the original quality of them, because some cassettes were not equal back in the day when they were originally made. Thanks everyone for bebopping along to check out everybody's records, tapes, CDs, and vinyl here in the Cincinnati area. Thanks for coming along to check out this record store here. If you like this kind of content, I do videos just like this each and every week. I will show you as soon as I get home all the goodies I scored from today's um, trip to the record store. Uh, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you on another episode. Bye, everyone. Bye.